Hello guys, Apex Rise here with another video, and um, this video is going to be a bit different. I wanted to try a video kind of like, just like, talking about cars, because as you guys know, I like cars, right? And I don't, I don't really talk about cars too much on this channel as much as I'd like to. So, I'd like to start a little new series where I kind of just talk and just talk about cars to you guys and... Uh, if you guys want, you can respond in the comment section down below. This will be a great way if you want to learn about cars, then, you know, watch these videos. Or if you just want to have, like, a car chat in the comments with me or something, because I'd be down. And I, I don't know, I just want, I want to talk about cars on this channel more often, and that's what this little series is going to be. Hopefully, if I can continue it, I always say I'm going to do a new series and never end up doing it. I'm really good for that. But, um, I'm going to try my best to continue this, but anyways... Let's get into it. I don't really know how to start it off because I've never done one of these videos before, obviously. But, um, hmm. As you guys may know, well, most of you should know, my two favorite cars is a Chevrolet Camaro and the other one is a 19. It doesn't really matter what year, 1993 or 4 or fucking 6. I don't even, actually, no, not 6. But 19, it doesn't really matter what year. But a Nissan 240SX, an S13, mind you with the um, pop-ups of course not the coupe I like the hatch a lot more but um yeah that is my favorite Japanese car and then a favorite American muscle car is Chevrolet Camaro my grandpa had three of them uh, he kind of just grew up with them and like I don't know I learned about them I liked them a lot especially the fifth gen Z01 that thing is fucking beautiful I love that thing a lot but um yeah my grandpa's got a 1970 Z28 RSSS Camaro, I'm pretty sure. And then he has a 2013 Hot Wheels Camaro. I think it comes with the, um, I can't remember what he said. He either said RSSS or S, just an SS. I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure it has, like, the RS exterior, like, nice stuff, like, on the outside, like, on, like, the cosmetic stuff. And then I'm pretty sure it's got, like, an LS3 out of a SS. Um, but yeah, anyways. I don't know. Like, Ooh, I, I have a good topic here. So, some of you may know that I am 15 years old. And, yes, well, if you didn't know, now you know I'm 15 years old. And I've been thinking about, like, what I really want my first car to be and, like, what I want to work for if I can get it. And, like, recently, I usually talk to this about, like, to my friend, like, Nathan or, like, Jaden or Tyrez a lot. But I really want a... In, this is a... This is a Japanese car, by the way. It is a infinity, a 2003 Infiniti G35 sedan, the four door, not the coupe, because that is way too expensive. I'm not the slap train over here, but I really want the four door. Now you're probably saying, well, it's probably almost just like, oh, okay. You're probably saying like it's just as expensive, or it's probably not even that much cheaper. The price to buy one off of like GG or like Auto Trader. Is nowhere as close. Nowhere as close. Like I could find one for like two, three grand right now, which is pretty good compared to the G35s out there, which are probably a lot more. So that that's just one thing. I'm pretty sure the um. Oh, shout out to Paul Samuel right there. That's his old rap. That's what Jaden has. That's Jaden in the game, by the way. But um, uh, I'm pretty sure the G35. Uh, sedan has the VQ 35 that the G35 has and the 350Z has so if I could get like a G35 sedan that would be awesome I would I would shit I'd, I'd be so happy that'd be awesome because um before I ever like before I even really thought about like ever getting that car I really really wanted a Lexus IS 300 which is like a smaller Lexus some of them come with 2J GE's which, and if you don't know what a 2JZ is, very popular, very, very popular engine that is found in Toyota Supras. And when I say Supras, I mean multiple, like they're, they're in multiple Supras, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. Um, they're in a whole lot of cars. Some people put swap them into like the new GT86 or like the BRZ. Sometimes you really don't see them in BRZs. Um, or like a 240 or um, in just multiple cars. But, um, 
yeah, I really wanted a Lexus IS300. It comes with a 2J GE, which means it's not turboed, which means it's naturally aspirated, and it's a lot less. It has a lot less power, and it's way better than daily. I really wanted one of those, but like I realized how expensive they are, and they're kind of difficult to find in my opinion. So I didn't. I don't know. I kind of just dropped that. I really wanted a 240. Too expensive, or it's either you're paying overpriced for something that's like it's like already modified or you're paying a really low price for something that's a piece of shit rust bucket all fucked up don't want to fix it because it's a waste of time i wanted those i really wanted a lexus gs gs 300 or 400 i think it is look it's a big lexus they also come with a 2jg some of them some of them some of them have like v8 stock i think but um i really wanted one of those big ass boat for a car oh my god it's so big orion on haggard garage this is his genesis here but just imagine this wasn't the 3.8 turbo r spec blah 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 but he has a genesis he had or still has basically a lexus uh i think it's gs300 but um there's a long story behind that car but um ever since i saw him drift it i really wanted one myself and i really wanted that for a first car but i don't know i kind of just dumped that idea because that thing's really big so first of all, it's a really big car. I bet it'd be a lot, a bit on gas, and I don't know. I kind of, I like it still. I just wouldn't want it. But like the G35 sedan, I'm really sticking with that. I really love those. They're just so nice. VQ life, the dank, like oh, it's just so nice. And if you didn't know, I'm pretty sure. I'm not sure which way it is. I don't know if you knew though. I think Nissan owns Infinity, or it's Infinity owns Nissan. I'm pretty sure it's Nissan owns Infinity though. That's why the VQ35 is in the G35 sedan and two-door and or in the coupe and the 350z if you didn't already know well now you know but um yeah also i really wanted a um bmw e36 but i don't know what happened to that that was like a one day thing i really wanted one i really want though an e46 not like the e46 m3 like two-door 335 or anything i want the four-door the nice sedan something with me in four-door cars would be awesome because i'd love to learn how to drift a four-door car before a uh, coupe or i'd love to learn how to drift a sedan before a coupe because like it'd just be really cool and i'd love that and oh wow we actually ran out of time there so um hopefully you guys enjoy this video please like comment subscribe for more videos like this i will be definitely doing this more often because i actually really enjoyed that but yeah like i said i really want an e46 or like an e46 sedan or a G35 sedan. More like, the, more likely, I want the G35 sedan though. But hopefully, you guys enjoyed. Please like, comment, subscribe for more videos, and um, see you guys with another episode, one of these episode talks in probably the next two weeks or next week. And car edit and stuff is gonna be worked on this week, and hopefully, uh, all this stuff will be out. But yeah, peace. Yeah.